Hey everybody, it's day 14 of the visibility challenge and our letter is in. This is Tracy of TracyLDarity.com. I'm an author, blogger, freelance content provider, and I also host a YouTube channel where I recap some of my favorite television shows, and you can find those at youtube.com backslash a view from Tracy's point. So my N word for today is name. A lot of times people want to know what's in a name. And so I want to talk about what's in the name of view from Tracy's point. So when I used to work for the city of Tampa many, many years ago, I used to have a co-worker and she sold Avon and Avon used to come out with a calendar every year and it would have like scenic pictures and things. And so one day I came into the office, went into, you know, went to my desk and there was this framed picture and it had came from one of her calendars and the picture was entitled A View from Tracy's Point. And so somewhere in the... I don't know if it was like in Michigan or something, but there is a lake, this beautiful lake in this wooded area, and it's called Tracy's Point. And so I have kept that picture with me, and it's actually, um, I keep like a keepsake box, and it's actually in that keepsakes box because, you know, it's important to me, and it meant a lot that somebody thought enough of me that when she saw the beauty of that picture, she also saw what she said was the beauty in me. And so that name has stuck with me. And I thought when I started blogging and, you know, doing book reviews, that that would be a great name. So I called it A View from Tracy's Point. So whenever you're giving a name to something, you know, make sure it has meaning to you. And I think that um, if it's something that's special to you, that means a lot to you, then you'll stick with it. And then also people ask me, because my publishing company is called Tegan Jazz Books, and so people ask me, well, what does Tegan Jazz mean? Well, Tegan Jazz is a combination of my daughter's names. So Tay is for Shante, Gan is for Morgan, and Jazz is for Jasmine. And I put it all together and came up with Tegan Jazz Books Presents. So N is for name, and make sure that the names that you use represent who you are. And as you can tell from my other videos, I believe in, I'm a very emotional person, and I believe that everything we do should come from the heart. So that's it for me. Take care and make sure when you're getting ready to brand yourself and name your business, that it's something that you really love. Take care, guys. Bye-bye.